Hi there, students. Frigid. Okay, frigid is an adjective. It means cold. Um, co extremely cold. So, this room is totally frigid. It's really cold in here. I don't know how you can live in such a frigid environment. Um, the uh, the fri the frigid Arctic wastes of the North Pole. Okay, so frigid, extremely cold, bitingly cold. Um, and then you can use this metaphorically to mean unfriendly, to mean very, very formal. They gave me a very frigid welcome. Yeah, they weren't t really happy to see me. They were rather frigid in the way they welcomed me. Um, their, uh, th their, their frigid behaviour gave me the feeling that they really didn't want me to be there. And then finally, you can use this word frigid, it's probably this meaning is a bit old fashioned, to talk about sex. And it's normally used to describe a woman who does not like sex. This word frigid now is considered offensive and I would recommend not using it. But, well, you, you might find it somewhere and that's this is an old fashioned meaning of it, but don't use it. OK, so frigid very cold, a very cold temperature. The air was frigid. On a frigid evening, we stood and sang carols in, uh, in, a, in a row. The uh, frigid atmosphere of a, uh, of the, a mm, garden party at Buckingham Palace. Yeah, so extremely stiff, extremely uh, formal, overly polite, overly formal, um, where you can't actually say anything. Um, the his prose, his book is right is rather frigid. It doesn't have any imaginativity. It's very precise and very perfect, but it's not really very interesting. So, very, very cold, yes, or a frigid atmosphere. Um, yeah, the, uh, the meeting with, the, with our opponents was rather frigid and uh, they, uh, uh, they, di they didn't want to do business with us. Um, I was given a rather frigid hello. The opening of the peace conference was was a rather frigid thing. So frigid air, frigid night temperatures. I jumped into the frigid water. <gasps> Gosh, that was cold. Um, it's been a very frigid winter. Um, all of this, well, in in Latin, well, the Romans, they used to like to have hot baths. But there was one room called the Frigidarium which was um, a bathhouse with cold water in it, water that hadn't been heated, and that's the cold room. So I guess you jump into the frigid water of the frigidarium. So frigid, um, lacking warmth, lacking feeling. Yeah, he frigidly refused my request. Um, the scientific community gave the theory a frigid welcome. Um, the uh, frigid, the frigid wastes of uh, of a, of a northern winter. Um, they met the uh, the proposal with a frigid reaction, a polite but frigid welcome, very stiff, very very formal. Um, the water was too frigid to uh, swim in. Yeah. Um, okay. So frigid, cold weather. Frigid, cold and unemotional. Frigid, cold, um, very formal, very stiff, terribly politely stiff. And then f uh, frigid, uh, talking about a woman who doesn't like sex, um, who, who doesn't enjoy it. Um, but this is really a rather taboo use and I recommend not using it. Um, then as to origin, OK, it comes from uh, Latin, frigidus, meaning cold, uh, frigus, cold, coldness, um, and 
formality, frigid, a frigid welcome. I think I'm going to give it a six in formality. I think you could use it anywhere, but it's a touch on the for on the formal side. They gave us a frigid welcome. Yeah, I use it anywhere, but it, it's a touch on the for more formal side. Best in something semi-formal or something formal. So enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a warm welcome, not a frigid welcome. Give it a, a rating. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you soon. Bye for now. Frigid.